This video may not be appropriate for children of 13 and under. Parental discretion is advised. Hi everyone, my name is Raziel K and I'm back with another tour review and today part 5 of the Tunji Luul Tank Alliance. And we're going to take a look at BP-35. Uh, nice little tank, you know, as you can see, similar to all the others, but very different uh, in the, uh, the mold. The transformation is very similar from like you you've seen earlier the two arms transform the same way uh the of course the top of uh, the torso and the bottom uh the you know the crotch area and the, they transform differently this is the right foot uh so its transformation is very similar to the left foot which we'll see uh to, well next time so but bp35 i like the paint on this guy long cannon you know so it's gonna be fun I'm loving this set so far and I can't wait to show you guys the combined mode. So thanks for coming by and make sure you check out my voice acting playlist, is the main feature of my channel, something I'm very proud of. And also check out DJC Collectibles, my sponsor, fantastic online store and at the end of this video you can get your 10% discount code for anything Transformers. And now let's roll the intro. And we're back with number five and today BP 35 and same instruction tank the robot robot the tank but this is our right foot yeah so it's very simple to do the uh, foot mode so uh, but let's get started love the details the paint feels good it's not gummy plastic you know it's smooth uh, Sturdy enough. So far, you know, I haven't had any fears of breaking it. Um, so I'm grateful for that. Uh, BB35 here is gonna need a name. So again, we have Larry, Jerry, Rick, Saint. Let's go with, uh, I don't know, I don't know, a good tank name. Uh, let's go with uh, Strobe. Yeah, Strobe. There you go. That's what I'm thinking, Strobe. Uh, and uh, that's gonna be his name and now we're going to uh, do the transformation I just wanna is there other yeah little details like little stairs big big roof or canopy or whatever you have the same articulation the gun the tower and there you go that's it treads are nice they kind of all have different treads just slightly different like these are not the same tread so i think that's pretty cool that they are very similar transformation and everything but at the same time different and that's that's cool so now to do the transformation for this guy you're gonna he did he, he doesn't fold up like the uh the hand so you have to unhook and move <clears throat> this way hold on I'm, there's always one part that I'm afraid to, there you go, I'm peg, I don't want to break anything, man it's tight, there you go, alright, so once that's done, they, oh, I guess I skipped a step accidentally, I want to move, this. this is tight, so this one's a little different, you have two little pegs here, and they go into two little holes, there you go, slight click, Oh yeah, the feet on this guy, there you go. Simple enough. I just realized I started with doing French word of the day and now I completely forgot. So let's go with, uh, well, pied, which means foot. There you go. So you unfold these two panels, unclip the, and you know, double joint the hand in front and not oh, reveal the head but can unclip unclip and flip down move there you go you have your hands you have your head and this one you have two clips here two holes there you go so he looks like blitzwing with his cannon on top so there you go 
I have strobe and robot mode. Let's do a quick uh, comparison. Let's do a quick comparison with a custom Raziel Kane figure that uh, Input painted for me. And I love this guy. Uh, the paint on it is amazing. It's a Siege Seeker mold. And it's fantastic. So there you go. So he's a Voyager size, just a tad taller than Strobe. All right, back to robot mode, uh, tank mode. Very simple. You fold the feet back in, clip it back together, take the hand and like double joint and clip it back, close it. There we go. Oh, yeah, you have to close it afterwards. And once you have that, you want to take this and reclip over the head. Come on. There you go. And wait, 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 too quick. Lift the chest up. Why is it not working? What am I missing? Ah, oh, there you go. All right, it was just real tight. So that's the thing, you wanna pry and push on the canopy, but you're afraid it's gonna break, so you don't. And then refold this. There you go. And then maybe I went too quick. Maybe I did. Uh, yeah, hold on. So I have to have this done first so that this. Come on. There you go. So once that's done. You put this back and then you have this clip here that's going to go in the inside of the wheel. Same thing on the other side. There you go. Now put the head back in and clip everything. And we're back with Stro BB35. So there you go. And now the foot mode. Now very carefully do these following steps. Very carefully. Take this, flip it there, and you take this, and you flip it down. That's it. Those are very, very difficult step for the foot mode. I swear, that's all it is. So there you go. So let's, can you stand like that? Oh, there you go. So that's, you know, he's a leg now. And that's going to be my review of BP35. I hope you've enjoyed this. I hope you are enjoying this series so far. Uh, you know, so you have Larry, Jerry, Rick, Saint, and Stro. So thanks for watching, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this review. If you did, please like, subscribe, and hit the bell. Also, leave a comment. I love reading those. Keep coming back. I have more on the way. And remember, nothing in life gives you a right to be an asshole. Take care.